episode of Fresh Bar Sports Show. I'm Jabari Harris. I'm your host and I'm your writer. And this week's episode, we just want to simply talk about All Star Week, uh, All Star Weekend. Excuse me. It's the Hawks saying steady, and it's the uh, Trey Young doing his thing still. They they end the uh, the All Star break on a good note. Good thing he's a, a All Star. Congratulations, Trey Young. He won't have a good All Star game tonight, but um, you know, going for Team LeBron. Rams won the Super Bowl 23-20. Matt Stafford, he he was okay. Joe Burrow, he was out there balling, doing his thing. Um, he had a good game, but I think the MVP should have went to Aaron Donald. They gave it to Cooper Cup. You know, so be it. That's just that's just how how, how it goes sometimes. But uh, everybody knows the real MVP was Aaron Donald. Defense out there was dominating. He's been out, uh, men out amongst boys out there. Half time show was great. I don't care what none of the critics got to say. It was great. It was for the culture. It's what we needed. It's what the people needed. Uh, it's what we, we, we had, you know, Snoop Dogg, Dr. Dre, Eminem, Mary J, 50 Cent, Kendrick Lamar. They was out there doing their thing. Uh, it, it, it was incredible. It was something real special. And I'm glad we got to see a, a hip-hop um, halftime show at the Super Bowl. It was well needed. Um, it, it was uh, well overdue. But... Um, we're glad uh, Jay-Z did what he did, working for, in the NFL and pulling his strings to uh, get a hip-hop halftime show. <sighs> Let's talk about AD Hurt again. Here we go again. Come on, AD. I told you I need you to be better than that. I need you to be out there balling, dominating out there, and I need you to be healthy out there. But you playing Hurt, here we go with this again. We need you to um, actually step it up even more. Everybody want to get on my man Russell Westbrook, but... Actually, for the whole season in its totality, AD, Anthony Davis actually been playing worse than um, Russell Westbrook. Russell Westbrook actually been playing decent and playing like how he's normally playing throughout his career, uh, you know, at, at, and career averages total. His numbers and the field goal percentages is all is all the same. You know, his, of course, his uh, triple-double numbers is going to be down, you know, playing alongside LeBron and AD. He's not going to be averaging triple-double, so don't, don't expect that, but... He's actually playing the way that he'd been playing throughout his whole career alongside the stars like Kevin Durant, James Harden, uh, Paul George, Carmelo Anthony, etc. You know, he played alongside the stars throughout his career. You know, Bradley Bill, etc. And then um, LeBron James and Anthony Davis now. But Anthony Davis, we need you to step up and do better. That's what we need you to do. Uh, I'm glad we actually get in, in the break with a W, though. That, that was good for us. You know we could have traded... Uh, we could have made a trade for Christian Woods uh, from the Rockets, but we didn't want to go over the luxury tax. I understand not want to go over the luxury tax and paying the fine and things of that nature, but when you're trying to get championship, you gotta, you, you billionaires, pay the money. It's, like you, you, it's monopoly out there. Pay the cost to be the boss. You want to win, pay, pay fines and things of that nature, pay money to get the team to be where you need the team need to be so you can get the championship. It's simple as that. Let's say about the NBA All Star Weekend. You got uh, the Peloton trainer guy. He he won the Celebrity All Star Game MVP. You know that was pretty entertaining out there. It, it was all right. You got uh, Miles Garrett out there dunking on these guys. Quavo out there balling. Tiffany Haddish out there doing her thing. Um, everybody was out. You know it was it was entertaining with celebrities. So it, it, it was decent. Kate uh, Cunningham he won the MVP for the. The Rising Stars Challenge for Team Barry. Uh, Obi Toppin, he won the dunk contest. Cat, uh, he won the uh, call Anthony Towns, he won the three point sh- uh, shootout. And um, the Cavs, they won the skills uh, competition. But the uh, dunk contest definitely was, was real dry. It could have it could have been much better, much better. That's that's an understatement. It is what it is. We saw pretty much every dunk in the world throughout decades, decades of of, of basketball. So um, what. We we gonna see things that we saw already, so uh, it, it's, it's gonna be still. Maybe they should do some way somehow of mixing it up with some N one stars or things of that nature, or some street bring some street guys in here to mix it up. Two street guys and two NBA players, or two N one guys and two NBA players, things of that nature to spice it up a little bit. That 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 that'd be great. Uh, I think they need to find some way somehow to. Uh, and just they gotta spice it up because these uh, you're not having superstars doing it. If you're not gonna bring the superstars, the guys that's actually playing on Sunday, Sunday, like the Sunday game, 
if you're not bringing the stars that's playing on the Sunday game and to participating on the Saturday night uh, dunk contest, uh, it's, 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 it's going to get the, the reviews um, that people was giving it like it was last night because uh, it was pretty it's pretty hard to be honest. But I, I, I love NBA All Star Weekend. I love NBA All, 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 All Star Game. I love it. It's a holiday to me. It's, it's the greatest thing. It's my Super Bowl. It's, it means everything in the world to me. NBA All Star Weekend. But uh, that dunk contest last night was uh, was, 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 was 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 not to be desired. Now let's talk about the NBA All Star Game that's actually about to kick off 2022. I'm Team LeBron, of course, because by default he's playing for my Lakers, and we're going for that. Even though I got my man representing the ATL, Trey Young, out there, my ATL folks, uh, I appreciate you out there doing your thing. But um, LeBron clearly got the better team. He he needs a, do I do I do I need to go through? You got Giannis out there, the Kupo. You got Steph Curry. You got uh, Donovan Mitchell. You got the jo- jo- Joker. You got you got the um, Demar Derozan, Chris Paul, the De- Darius Garland, Jimmy Butler, Jerry Allen. Luca, you got the um pretty Freddie Elite and LeBron himself. It, it doesn't matter who else is on on on, on team Kevin Furnett. You know why Kevin Durant's not even playing the game? Uh it's gonna it's gonna get ugly like how it was last, last year. Remember the ATL, how we was doing in the ATL last year for the NBA All Star game, my birthday weekend, NBA All Star Game weekend. Uh it got real ugly. That that game was real embarrassing. It was, they, they waxed them out there. It's going to um, be something similar to that tonight, real soon. Now, in closing, P.S. on a side note, I just want to shout out my Pittsburgh Steelers for signing um, Brian, Brian Flores to the to, to the um, coaching staff. I don't care if he's just some assistant, you know, linebacker, coach, assistant, you know, this. I don't care about that. He, he got the job, and he's still suing the league, still staying firm in his ground. And um, he still got a job in the league, so I'm glad my team was able to stand up and um, and um, represent him and um, stand by him. So I appreciate that. Pittsburgh Steelers stand up. So the nation, that's what we're talking about. Now, uh, let's enjoy this NBA All Star game. It's gonna be a thing of beauty. I love it. I appreciate it. And um, everybody, let's just. Um, Let's just watch, watch this amazing basketball that these superstars are about to give us. Appreciate you watching this episode of Fresh Bar Sports Show. We're going to let this cook, let this marinate, let this bubble up. And we're going to stay tuned up 